All right, Lionel's. What'd you get, Julie? Just all kinds of stuff. Jaws. Ah, uh, Julie, what do you got? All this Mark's furniture. Yeah. And I have a bunch of these dolls. I don't even know. So 50 for all of it. They're all 60s, 50s. Furniture. Check this out. This is like legit 50s. Yeah, it's so cool, right? Yeah. Got a bunch of stuff. I got the whole bin for uh, 50. Okay. Yeah. All right, what's going on guys? Just brought everything home. I'm gonna start out with the Blue Comet train. Pretty good finds today. Um, it looks like it's gonna rain. Um, pretty gray out there, but uh, yeah, let's get to it. Uh, Blue Comet train, Lionel lines. Again, these have been in the basement for a long, long time. And uh, super cool. Just need a little bit of a cleanup. Um, I'm not gonna do much to them, but uh, yeah, they need to get the dust off of them. This one, it looked like it had some water on it, uh, but yeah, is with the boxes. These are the original boxes, 75 each. These can go for decent money. This is the Blue Comet Lionel. Um, there's one on eBay listed right now for some really good money. Um, that one does have the like the original big box that it came with, so it's a little bit of a different kind of game plan but picked up this tonka picked up a ton of corgis today i'll show you these um and also uh techno the denmark company technos so a ton of cool cool cars had some good deals i one guy grabbed red lines i wasn't able to get any red lines but that's okay pick this up if you know what it is let me know i think i paid a couple dollars for it pretty neat little robot some vintage cars here picked up this jaws game um really mint condition it's by ideal and if you see that right there it has like all the different things that um you put into the jaws again probably one of my favorite movies of all time as far as like scary movies but yeah there it is it's pretty scary right julie the Jaws. Oh yeah, I don't like that. Dun, 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 Julie grabbed this one. All right, guys, time to finish up the video. It started raining on me outside. So we got the blue comet right here. Just wanted to give you a couple more views of the train. Super cool train. Um, Again, the boxes were really crucial to me picking it up. Uh, if anybody knows what this is from, pick this up. I think I paid up for this, um, paid about uh, over $10 for this item. Um, but it looks vintage from like a car, like a little driver. Um, got some good deals over here. Vintage uh, Tootsies, you know, vintage Tootsie toy. Um, another Tootsie. Got this little vintage dump truck with the wheel that probably needs to be possibly glued. It might crack off. It might not. But, uh, yeah, a couple cars. Picked up this Vion Dot. Uh, this is a tanker. Got the tanker on top. Tanker truck. Again, the box is here. This is a blue robot. I forget exactly what it's called, but uh, it's by Monogram. Uh, if you ever see these, um, these are pretty cool. A uh, little kit from vintage kit that you would put together. These are expensive if you buy them brand new. Um, there's the Jaws right here. A really cool set. So it's got all the instruction in, is in here and all that stuff. So good condition. There's the Tonka. Picked up this variety of uh, smaller cars. So a nice little find of different vintage cars, Corgis, stuff like that. Yeah, these were there were some good deals here. And they bundled it up for me. This is uh, look a made in Israel Chevelle station wagon. Pretty cool. So nice, there's a Beetle by uh, Tonka. And uh, people, some people own a real one like this. They're super, super neat. And uh, if you can work on them, they're definitely 
cool cars to have something that stands out. VW Beetle. Picked up a little Nylant. Picked up these uh, $6 million Man. These can go for some serious money if you have them with the box. Um, there's the Bionic Woman, $6 million Man. Jay West. Figurine from Marks. There's Vintage. All kinds of um, elves and stuff like that. These are the flocked Santa Claus. These are good around Christmas. And just like a variety of, uh, I think they're Benton, Baton, Cowboys, and different figures in here that we got. Okay. Julie's got a bunch of marks over there. So, yeah, pretty, pretty good, uh, pretty good find today. Again, the Lionel was an awesome, awesome find. Um, it looks like they just sat in the basement for a long time. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, it was definitely a great day. Woke up super early today. You have to. You got to be, like, one of the first ones in line for some of these sales where there's, like, some serious stuff. Uh, I missed out on red lines. Um, this one really cool dude, I was talking to him. He picked up the red lines, so... I'm glad he got them. Um, he said there wasn't that many, but he got a few red lines, a couple other things. There was a lot of good clothes. I wasn't really looking for clothes today. There was a lot of like college shirts, 90s college shirts by like Lee and other brands, but I just, I spent a bunch of money, so I didn't really want to deal with the clothes and stuff like that. I was happy with what we got, and uh, Julie got like a ton of dollhouse stuff, so there's just a whole whole variety of it different uh different dollhouse pieces and just just like a lot of it basically yeah so there's a lot to look through but yeah it is a great great sale i'm super happy and if you like this video give it a thumbs up it totally helps us with the algorithm uh lets us know that you enjoyed the video and uh if you're not subscribed yet feel free to hit that subscribe button and uh, yeah, let us know what kind of items you found this weekend. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.